The essence of vacationing in Germany is possibly best summed up by its history, culture, and natural beauty. When it comes to picking unique places to visit in this stunning region of Europe, travelers are spoiled for choice thanks to its numerous historic cities and charming small villages, as well as an abundance of forests and mountains. Visit the bigger cities like Munich, Frankfurt, or Hamburg if you want to go sightseeing or enjoy the arts. Consider visiting areas like the magnificent Bavarian Alps, the Black Forest, or the Rhine Valley if you're seeking for leisure activities. There are beautiful historic cathedrals and opulent palaces around, and numerous centuries-old customs, like as traditional Christmas markets, festivals, and fairs, are still observed in the smaller towns and villages, some of which have still standing original medieval old towns. Watch our video of the top tourist attractions in Germany for suggestions and ideas to help you organize your trip. 1. Brandenburg Gate Berlin The massive sandstone Brandenburg Gate in Berlin's Mitte neighborhood was the first neoclassical building in the city and was constructed for King Frederick William II in 1791. It was designed after the Acropolis in Athens. With the Quadriga, the magnificent four-horse chariot pulling the goddess of victory, situated atop this magnificent structure, it stands an astonishing 26 meters tall. Each side of the building's six enormous columns forms five imposing passages. Four of them were utilized by general traffic, while the center was set aside for the royal vehicles. Huge Doric columns are also employed to embellish the two structures that used to house guards and toll collectors on either side of the gate. It's difficult to imagine that the gorgeous building you see today, which is unquestionably Berlin's most recognizable structure, was badly damaged during WW2. It was also formerly a portion of the famed Berlin Wall, which represented the partition of Berlin into East and West for a number of decades. 2. Cologne Cathedral Unquestionably Cologne's most stunning feature is the soaring Cologne Cathedral, also known as the Cathedral of St. Peter and St. Mary, which is situated on the banks of the Rhine. This cathedral, one of the biggest in all of Europe, is a marvel of high Gothic design. This most enormous construction undertaking of the Middle Ages began in 1248 and reportedly took more than 600 years to finish. The cathedral's spectacular interior, which measures 6,166 square meters and has 56 enormous pillars, is every bit as imposing as its exterior. The Reliquary of the Three Kings, a 12th century work of art in gold, was created by Nicholas of Verdun to store the three kings' relics that were transported here from Milan. It is located above the high altar. The three kings' chapels stained glass from the 12th and 13th centuries, as well as the treasury's collection of priceless items, all of which survived World War II, almost undamaged, are further highlights. Climb the 533 steps to the viewing platform in the South Tower for some of the best views of the city and river. There is a nominal admission fee. 3. The Black Forest One of the most popular highland areas in all of Europe is the stunning Black Forest, which is known for its dark, heavily forested hills. It's a hiker's paradise, stretching 160 kilometers from Fotsheim in the north to Wildschut on the High Rhine in the south, in the southwest corner of Germany. The Black Forest slopes more gently to the upper Neckar and Danube valleys on the east side while descending steeply to the Rhine on the west. Popular locations include the charming resort of Bad Liebenzell, the excellent spa facilities of Baden Baden, and the oldest ski area in Germany, Tochno. Among other sites is the magnificent Black Forest Railway. The Black Forest Open Air Museum is located in Tribiak, which is also the location of the famed falls. How can I catch them all the best? Get a map of the Black Forest panoramic route a 70-kilometer driving trip that features some of the area's best views, as well as its most popular historic sites, such as magnificent castles and a variety of medieval towns and villages. 4. 
the Rhine Valley. The Rhine is not only the most significant waterway in Europe, but it is also the most stunning. This majestic river flows from Switzerland through Germany and on to the Netherlands for a distance of 1,320 kilometers. There are numerous locations in Germany where you may enjoy the beautiful Rhine, but the gorgeous Upper Middle Rhine Valley, which has been recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, is undoubtedly the most well-liked among tourists. More than 40 castles and almost 60 charming medieval towns may be found along this 65-kilometer section of the river, which is frequently dramatic. These places are simply waiting to be discovered by river crews or by car. Looking for a fantastic starting point for your trip through the Rhine Valley? A nice place to begin is the old town of Bingen, where the river flows through a narrow gorge before entering the Backerrack Valley. 5. Mackienplatz. This tourist landmark, which is conveniently located in Altstadt's old town, is one of the greatest spots to begin your tour of Munich. The illustrious Henry the Lion founded it in the 12th century so that it could be used for battles, celebrations, and medieval marketplaces. The square is still a well-liked gathering place for locals and tourists today. Since 1158, it has served as the principal square and has been widely acknowledged as the city's center. Due to its close proximity to the city, it serves as a hub for access to all the top tourist attractions. Mackienplatz, a sizable plaza where traders from all over Bavaria would gather to conduct business and where locals would gather to shop and witness medieval jousting competitions, served as the focal point of this elevation. These days, this large plaza continues to draw large crowds of people, but for various reasons, they come here for sightseeing or perhaps to enjoy a meal at one of the stylish cafes and restaurants on the square or to buy in its distinctive boutique stores. 6. Bumbach, which is situated on seven hills and is one of Bavaria and Germany's most picturesque towns is crossed by the Rignitz River and several canals. Well flooded into its streets and architectural wonders were built all around town since it previously served as the headquarters of the Roman Catholic Archdiocese of Bumbach, and for a brief time, as the heart of the Holy Roman Empire. As a result, history and tradition are present everywhere. Altstadt's winding, medieval streets are especially fascinating to wander through, and beautiful Romanesque cathedral and a historically significant Rathaus can be found here. Nearby structures include the towers of Altenborg Castle and the twin spires of Michaelsborg Abbey. Today, Bumbach is a very attractive and enjoyable destination to visit, and it is full of sidewalk cafes, pubs, and eateries. Numerous of them offer its renowned smoked beer, which may also be tried in any of the numerous breweries dotted across the city. 7. The Zugspitze Massif, which is a portion of the Wetterstein mountain range, lies on the border between Germany and Austria and is encircled by deep valleys. The Bayagisch Zugspitzbahn, a cog train or a cable car can take you to the eastern summit which rises to a height of 2,962 meters and is capped by a golden cross. Taking the Tickoler Zugspitzbahn, a railway that ascends to the Zugspitzkamp station at 2,805 meters, is another fantastic opportunity to take in this region's remarkable natural splendor. From here, a cable car can be used to continue the journey to Zugspitz West Jitful Station which is located at 2,950 meters. Make sure to try a dinner at this location's wonderful panoramic restaurant. The opportunity to stroll through an 800-meter-long tunnel with viewing windows to the Schneefernerhaus station at the summit of the Bavarian Cog Railroad is one of the journey's highlights. You can climb up to the eastern summit's viewing platforms from here. Zugspitze is a fantastic winter destination in Germany because of the numerous ski areas that are close by. 8. Koenigsee Lake One of the outstanding natural attractions in the German region known as Berchtesgadener Land is the picturesque Bavarian Lake of Koenigsee. 
This region in Salzburg, often known as the King's Lake, is a hiking and biking haven thanks to its extensive network of trails. The lovely trail that runs along the east bank of the Koenigsee to the Mollewinkel is one of the most well-liked activities. It is famous for its outstanding views of the lake and the surrounding mountains and is also known as Painter's Corner. Taking a boat to the 17th century pilgrimage chapel of St. Bartholomew at the southern end of the lake and then walking there to reach the Obersee is another equally appealing tourist option. The most well-known tourist destination and one of the most well-liked mountain resorts in the Bavarian Alps is Bursch Teskodun, which is located near the terminus of the Da Itsha Ipen Sitgas. Bursch Teskodun National Park should also be mentioned here. Since 1990, this area of exceptional natural beauty has been recognized by UNESCO as a World Heritage Site. 9. Gothenburg one of the most alluring destinations along Germany's well-known romantic road tourist circuit is the old Franconian imperial city of Gothenburg. It is noteworthy for its walls and towers, which have remained unaltered since the Thirty Years' War of 1618, and is situated on the rocky banks of the scenic river Tauber. The fascination of this picture-perfect, perfectly preserved medieval town is unending. Joining a walking tour is one of the most well-liked things to do in Gothenburg. For those who would rather be their own tour guide, start by obtaining a map from one of the town's tourism offices. A timeless experience is simply strolling through the historic neighborhoods past these stunning structures, especially if the route passes by the Plune Line, one of the town's most gorgeous locations. After all of that exploration, Finish your trip in one of the town's many elegant eateries. If you're traveling in the winter, make sure to stop here for the customary Christmas market, which attracts visitors from all around the nation and even farther afield. 10. Neuschwanstein Castle The charming ancient town of Fussen, a well-known alpine resort and hub for winter sports, is a fantastic starting point from which to visit the neighborhood's Neuschwanstein Castle. It is nestled between the Amergau and Allgäu Alps. One of the most famous and gorgeous royal castles in all of Europe is unquestionably this magnificent medieval fortification. From 1869 until 1886, King Ludwig II of Bavaria constructed this fantasy fortress with numerous towers and battlements, which is credited with serving as the model for Walt Disney's enduring theme park castles. There are many different tour options available, including guided tours of the opulent interior that include the throne room, the singer's hall, and some of the most breathtaking views in the nation.